Hey YouTube, it's Afro Meek and I'm back with another lock style tutorial. This is just like a braid updo that I did and basically what I did was I took my hair into different sections and braided them and then I just kind of crisscrossed the braids over each other on the top and then got down the middle to make an updo. So I'll show it to you and then I'll take it down and um, I'll take it down back down to the braids and just kind of show you how I crisscrossed it. And because I just worked with kind of whatever placement worked, I'm sure when I redo it, it's not going to look exactly like this. But you'll get an idea of just something you can do when you braid your hair and to put it up into a different style. So this is the front. This is the top. Side. And let me show you the back. Okay, so now I'm going to take it down and I'll be right back to show you what I did. Okay, I'm back and I put on some earrings because the plain look was not working for me. Okay, so I took my hair down and you can see the braids that I had them in and they're kind of going everywhere because they were in that little style for a minute. So, they're going crazy. But, um, what I did as far as my sections was, I didn't want to do boxes. So I just tried to make sure that I kind of did some different sections and then I kind of knew how I wanted these to cross. So I was kind of particular in how I did these two sections up there. But I can show you kind of the sectioning so you can see it's not, you know, kind of any kind of uniform shape. Okay, and if your hair is shorter than mine, I believe you could still do this style. It just needs to be kind of long enough to braid it to get it in some decent size, um, decent length braids to be able to kind of fold them over each other. So, what I did was I started kind of with the top section, and I kind of look in my mirror to see what I'm doing. And so it's kind of like basket weaving your hair with braids in it a little bit because you're just kind of crossing them over each other. Well, I guess in basket weaving, you'd have a section that went straight back, I guess, so maybe it, it is different. But I just kind of crossed it like that, and then, like I said, I just kind of went one, one side to the other side, and I guess that's how. It's kind of like basket weaving. And just kind of working the section like that. I think I was that side there. Right there. And I think at this point I'm going to pin it. And I just used regular hair pins. I have the larger ones, but they don't seem to work much better for me, so I don't use them that often. So I feel a little loose. So I'll put another pin right there. Okay, so that's pretty much, I think, where I stopped with the top of it because it kind of seemed like the rest of them weren't going to go. So in the back, and I think that one's coming apart. But let me turn around. Let's see. Let me try to take that off then. I'm just gonna put that in the middle to do it. To do something with it. Let's see. Put that over there. That over there. Grab another pin. And I don't remember what side I left off with, so I'm just going to go with it. I'm just going to tuck under this other one. Yeah. 
Okay, so I'm not sure how it's looking. So I'm going to pin it and then I'm going to look at it and see what went right, what went wrong. Okay, let me grab my mirror and see. It didn't turn out exactly the same. It didn't turn out that bad either. I could see where I could kind of move some around and maybe make it better. But I don't think it's too bad. And I think you get the idea of kind of what I did with it. And then this is like a style. I guess you could always switch it up, you know. You're gonna cut, it's going to turn out different each time. So, you know, different hairstyle each time. <laughs> okay, so I think you got a good visual here. But I'll turn again. And I'll pin the loose ones as I'm turning. Yeah, so I can see that it's kind of like sticking out weird. And okay. So here's the front. There's the back. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed the style, and thanks for watching. Bye.